Hunter Lewis. Today is the day I have dreamed of and prayed for. I can't believe it is finally here. I remember one of the first times I thought this could be it. I think he could be my person. We were in the pool at the condo, just messing around and playing with each other. You did something that made me laugh and we started giggling at each other like little kids. He looked at me and said, I love you. It slipped out. I could tell you were embarrassed because we hadn't been together that long. And you didn't mean to say it that soon. I just laughed. As you then started acting like you were drowning yourself to avoid the situation. Hearing those words from you made my stomach flip with excitement. I knew I was done for then. It was all you. Oh my gosh. You look unbelievable. Thank you. Oh my it's cancer too. All the times you're not around, it's like you saved me. Pulled me up from off the ground. The words we speak of such a lovely sound. When you say. day you become my wife. I told you the day I asked you to marry me that I knew from day one. I even called mom that night and told her. I cannot believe out of all the men in this world that I, Hunter Lewis, is the lucky one that gets to marry you, Allie McGraw. Not sure what I did or right, but I'm sure glad I did it. I always wondered my whole life who it would be walking down the aisle when the day came. And I'm so incredibly grateful that it's going to be you. You have this special gift, Allie. A gift that allows you, no matter where you are, you bring joy to people's lives. You make people happy. As soon as you walk in a room, people light up, and your loving and caring personality showers them. Allie, I love every single inch of you. And honestly, thank you so much for just loving me. I vow to be by your side through anything life throws at us. When we are going to have struggles, heartbreak, and bad days, but Allie, I vow that any day will be a blessing to me as long as it begins and ends with you. Allie, you are my strength when I feel weak and you are my comfort when I feel anxious and I would not be who I am today if I would have not been lucky enough to meet you. I've prayed my whole life for this moment, Allie, this day with you. Here we go. See you soon. I love you. Hunt. back on the past four and a half years, I remember how you've been there for me through it all, through the good, the bad, and all the ups and downs of life. I love you endlessly, Hunter Lewis. Let's get married. Love, your wife, almost, Allie. husband and wife, you make this. I am so blessed that God chose you to be my husband. 
I am so thankful for the last four and a half years with you. But I know this is just the beginning of our story. I am so excited for all the new first we will get to experience together. Whether it is our first home, our first child, or the first gray hair, I want to do it all with you. Paul and I and some other people are coming up the river out here in our boat. So we're coming up and we decided to make a loop and turn around and I pointed out, I said, hey, that's, I said, that's McGraw's house right there. Do you remember that? I said, that's McGraw's house actually right there. It was just ironic. We turned around right there. And uh, she said, that's Allie McGraw's house. I said, well, yeah. So Paul, I think Paula looked over there and said, in a nutshell, I think she said, that's, she's the one. That's her. You know, I'm pointing at her house. And as every parent in this room that, that has their kids, you pray for them that from the day they come into the world and whatever they're doing. Like I said before, Hunter, you've done a lot of great things and we're proud of you. Uh, but this one, this, this is your masterpiece.